this is the car you look out as you can see yeah. it's nicely done you can see from the flower beds that this place is well kept beautiful rails uh, the guardrails very good for um, the elderly and, in, and if anyone brings children they're quite helpful indeed from this poor bandage point you can see the canyon and the lookout further down there so we will take the path and walk down after taking a walk down there you might want to come and come back and sit, take a seat just to take a, a breather or a rest or you want to use this you might want to use this place for a picnic as well so those benches are become very handy the ambience of this place is unparalleled the scenic views beautiful indeed look at the canyon closely The vegetation here is just beautiful. From this vantage point you can see the extent of the canyon. can see colleagues also taking the, the trip with us going down to the car hill look at it. that's the car hill sign Sign there. So pretty much similar to what you see if you go to the Echo Point in Blue Mountain. Sort of same sort of setup. You have different vantage points to look at the canyon. So there is one feather down there, it's much closer to the cliff. There is some descriptions here giving directions as to uh, different things, different locations. It's a very hot day today. Temperatures are soaring in the uh, 30s. So apologies for the picture quality there is not very good. Um, I'm going to the cliff lookout point. It's further down. I'm just looking at that sort of shape of the rock. It's like somebody has molded it into that particular shape. From time to time, I'm experiencing a bout of wind. Mm. 
Now I am by the cliff now. I can say I can the cliff lookout can accommodate maybe about up to eight people standing and looking into the canyon. Eucalyptus. Eucalyptus this tree. is all eucalyptus guys that you can see deep down wow, there. It's, so it's approximately huge. 300 meters down. Very deep indeed. So you can see some homesteads further down there. Uh, people live in this deep valley. It's amazing how look at the rocks further down there. Really amazing. Uh, look out and colleagues across there. Enjoying the scenery. What a beautiful place it is. To look out. I'm just bringing that rock much closer to us to see. And there it is. Quite a view of that particular area. type of bushes that you get here pretty awesome and there you have it this is the Cahill lookout really 1.8 kilometers like four minutes Look out, map. And some information here. So, depicted on the map is sort of uh, the, the various um, walks that you can take. So, where is it? The Fairfax Heritage Walk Track is 15 to 45 minutes. So. Where are you? Are we here? Oh, we are here. So there. Okay, they are not depicted here, but because these are other rocks to see. Taking the Fairfax walk now. Well done, footpaths. Just greeting some colleagues there that we are meeting on the way. This is breathtaking. Thank you. 
I must say there is still some construction taking place at this moment. This is uh, December 2022, so hopefully the construction work will be finished soon. But yeah, it it will add to the security of this place, especially that is given that this is the cliff. So from this vantage point, you can have a view of the cliff. Um, pretty much from the east. So we're looking at the cliff from the east side. Um, it's a very huge canyon. Uh, further down there we can see a stream which runs past from the east to the west. We're going to have a look at the canyon again from the west side. Like I said, this is new construction work. The guardrails are really new, but very much adding to the ambience of the place. This lookout. Speed again. walking trails so if you like walking this might be a good um, place for you to visit about 16 walking trails some of the infrastructure here Just in case uh, the rain 
But then comes while you're here. You can sit down. You can sit and enjoy it.